five, six, seven, eight. You're lucky I just saved your life. You need to be paying more attention. All right, guys, uh, we need to head to the game soon, so let's start painting faces. Sorry about that, Felicia. I'll make sure I fully know the routine before the competition in two weeks. Wait, <laughs> you're planning on competing with us? <laughs> you're just an alternate. You're not competing. I'm, I'm sure someone will be replacing you soon. But I've been practicing. I don't have time for this. Why don't you go join the other girls, OK? If you don't like her, then why'd you let her on the squad? Chris, why else? Plus, she's not gonna be performing with us long. She's only in since Natalia got hurt. I still can't believe Natalia's out for the whole season. So sad what happened to her. Especially since she was our best flyer. Hey, Chris. Hey, Felicia. We're just saying hi before the game. Nice number. Thanks. You know I'm your biggest cheerleader. Chris! Hey! Are you ready for tonight? The question is, are you ready? You better score lots of points or you're in big trouble. Wow, that's a lot of pressure. Hey, Daisy. Do you think you can go check on the pom-poms in the locker room? Sure, Felicia. See you, Chris. Hey, thanks again for giving her a chance on the team. All she's ever wanted to do is be a cheerleader. No problem. I mean, her skills speak for themselves. She's a natural. I'm glad to hear it. Anyway, we'll see you at the game. Yeah, uh, hey. Also, I was wondering, are you busy Friday? Because if not, I was thinking maybe we could get milkshakes. Sure, yeah, I'm not doing anything. All of the pom-poms are out of the locker room. Great. And another thing, uh, can you change your number? I already have 13. <laughs> but 13's my brother's number. I know, but I'm captain, so I get first dibs. Sorry. Oh, OK. Out of curiosity, what happens if we don't find someone to replace Daisy before the competition? I'd rather have one less girl than let her perform with us. And besides, this will be a last performance. I just have to make sure Chris doesn't find out. What are you going to do with that? Let's just say, on Fridays, we were orange. <laughs> People seem to love the new routine. Yeah. I just feel like we need a way of taking it up a notch. By the way, did you see Daisy? Whatever. She honestly wasn't that bad. Maybe you should give her a chance. <laughs> That's a good one. It's not about her skills, it's about the way she Hey, looked. Felicia. Do you think I could try being a flyer? Are you kidding me? You're not even coordinated enough to dance. Really? I thought I did well today. Can you think about it and- I don't want to lead you on, Daisy. You're not flying. Oh, before I forget, have you ever thought about tanning? No, why? Well, we're gonna start using body glitter. Looks good on tan skin. Since my skin's pale, I'm using this. I think you should too. Uh, okay. How much do I put on? A lot. Actually, I'll put some on for you right now. Is that too much? No, not at all. It's gonna look great. And I'll give you the bottle so you can take it home with you. Put some more on, okay? Oh, uh, make sure to put it all over your face. Daisy's still not here. I know. Tanner should keep her out for three games at least. Sorry I'm late. Hey, I was wondering where you were. I think there's something wrong with that lotion you gave me. When I woke up, my skin was like this. Did you not use it? No. Guess I forgot to. So I'm guessing you're not going to be cheerleading with us today, then? I mean, I would have been embarrassed to even show up here looking like a Oompa Loompa, so I completely understand. I don't mind. Willy Wonka is one of my favorite movies. And besides, it should be off soon. I'm going to go warm up. Bye, guys. Oompa Loompa doop -a -doop -a -doop. I can't help but feel bad for her. I mean, she's so sweet. Don't. She makes our whole team look bad. Now I have to kick it up a notch.
All right, guys, I want everyone on their A game since the competition's around the corner. So let's try it again before we head to the courts. Natalia! Hey, guys. Uh, even though I'm out of commission, I figured I'd still come support y'all from the sidelines. I see you're in good hands with your new captain. It's definitely not the same without you, but we're doing our best to get by. Well, the doctor says my recovery's going well, so hopefully I'll be back soon. Uh, where's the new girl, Daisy? I don't know. She's been showing up late a lot lately, which is concerning. If I had a guess, she isn't. Hey, what's wrong? My uniform's ruined. Oh my gosh. Wait, did somebody literally cut up your uniform? I don't know. That is so bad. I'm sorry, Daisy. Can I still cheer? Unfortunately, no. As Natalia can tell you, you have to be in uniform to cheer. She's right. Unless... What size are you? A small. Why? Well, since I'm not using my uniform, you could just have mine. I'm sure it'll fit. I mean, you can at least try. Okay. Thanks. How do you like being on the team? I love it. My real dream is to be a flyer, but I don't think I'll ever be able to. Why couldn't you? My old coach used to tell me, Natalia, you can do anything you put your mind to. I really like that. I'm guessing it was you behind the cut-up uniform? Can't believe it didn't work. I don't even know why Natalia had to show up. I think you're taking this too far. We're not far enough. I don't want to do this, but I guess I'm going to have to go nuclear. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. All right, that was good, but I know we can do better, so let's try it again from the top. We've been practicing for two hours straight with no break. Can we take 10? Yeah, I'm tired. You're obviously not tired if you have enough energy to keep complaining. You're right, sorry. I can keep going. Actually, you know what? This will be a great time for us to practice flying. If you still want to, that is. Really? Yeah. I mean, we need a stronger ending if we're going to win the competition. So, who else better to do it than you? You want me to do the finale? Yeah, I would love that. Can I start with something easy, like a smush? No. Let's start with prep. Uh, Candace, can you and uh, Katie help me? Well, that might be too hard. She'll be fine. You know all the basics, don't you, Daisy? Yeah, but I've never tried it. You'll do great. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, 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 five, six, seven, eight. Ow! My ankle! Ow! Oh my gosh, are you okay? My ankle, it hurts so bad! I'm so sorry, I have no idea how I fell. Um, do you think it's sprained? It feels like it is. Well, you're probably gonna have to lay off of it for a few weeks and definitely get an x-ray. We're gonna have to do the competition without you, but we'll manage. Congrats on the win, again. You played amazing. Thanks. It was a team effort. I mean, at this rate, you guys are on track for finals. I really hope we win. Me too. Speaking of which, your guys' competition is in a week, right? How are you feeling about that? I was feeling good, but now all I can think about is Daisy. I really wanted her there with us, especially with how good she was going. Yeah. Well, I haven't talked to her since my mom took her to the hospital. Hopefully it's not as bad as we think. Daisy said you lost your balance. Yeah, I feel horrible. I hope you're not mad at me. Thanks. It was an accident. It could happen to anybody. Don't beat yourself up over it. And the best thing you can do is win the competition for Daisy. You're right. For Daisy. You know, it's, it's crazy. I really feel like my life is falling into place recently. I mean, I'm captain of the cheer team. The competition's right around the corner. And I'm getting to hang out with you. Well, let's not forget the most important part. These milkshakes are amazing. <laughs> Can I try? Oh my God, definitely the best part.
You guys should have seen the performance. And listen to that crowd. The only way that we're going to win is if we give this everything that we've got. Even with a new routine, it's going to be really hard without... Daisy! Hi, guys. I missed you. Hey, I I'm shocked to see you here. I, th I thought you... It, it wasn't as bad as it looked. I think we should do the ending we talked about with me flying. No. There's no way I'm letting you do that without a ton of practice. I'm not risking it. Oh, I have been with Natalia. Someone in a cast can't teach you to fly. And in case you didn't get the memo, Natalia's not on the team. Hey guys, good news. The doctor cleared me for cheer, so I'll be taking over as captain again. Thanks for helping in the meantime, Felicia. What? No, no, you can't do this. Not right before the competition. You know, I can't help but find it odd that Daisy fell the same exact way as I did with you holding us. It's almost as if it happened on purpose, you know? I don't know what you're implying, but if you're saying that I would save it, Felicia, when you tried to sabotage Daisy with the tanning lotion, I wasn't happy about that. And then cutting up her uniform? Way too far. But now that I know that you tried to hurt Daisy the same way Natalia fell, now it all makes sense. So you did all of that on purpose? No, no, I would never. You're really gonna betray me like this right now, Candace? I think I speak for everyone when I say, bye, Felicia, you're off the team. And just wait until I tell my brother about this. Sorry about not saying anything sooner, Daisy. Just so you know. Next up, Supreme Cheer. OK, we can talk about this later, but for now, we have a competition to win. Are you still good with the ending we practiced? Yeah, but I just got a bit nervous. Don't be. Like I said, you can do anything. I put my mind to. Thanks for the reminder. Let's go. It. I still can't believe how quickly you learned it. That's why I think you deserve this. Really? No, you deserve it. I would have never learned those moves if it wasn't for you. Okay, well, for next year, I really want to Oh, you were so good. I was like, that's my sister. Ah! Natalia, it's so good to have you back. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> oh, Natalia and I were planning to get food to celebrate. Want to join? Oh, if that's okay, Natalia. Yeah, I, I don't mind. I'd love to. <laughs> Actually, I know a place that makes the most incredible milkshakes. You would not believe. I'm so proud of you. other routine it just kills my soul same what are we supposed to do our competitions in a week well does anyone have any ideas I mean you're the new captain Taylor you're supposed to have the ideas I have something oh yeah shoot that ball Shoot that ball, A, A, shoot that ball, A, A, shoot that ball. I 
love it. Your first week here and you're already leading the squad. Maybe you should become captain. Seriously, did you know Taylor transferred to our school from Oakdale? Low income public school, ew. I didn't know that. So is Oakdale gonna be in the competition too? Yeah, they don't usually place, but this year they have this new girl Keisha as their captain and I heard they've got a really good routine this year. Which is why we need a new captain, to make sure we don't lose to them. Just think about it, okay? We should all hang out sometime. Really? Uh, yeah, for sure. I'm gonna go get some food right now if you girls wanna come. I can't today, but how about this weekend? We'll text you. That sounds good, I'm excited. Roxy Super for captain. captain. <laughs> Hey, you cheer for Castlemont? Oh, uh, yeah, I transferred there and joined the team. My mom and I moved here from Burbank. No way. Our old Captain Taylor, she just transferred there too. Yeah, she's really sweet, but now we have a new captain, our girl Keisha. Yeah, and she just choreographed a routine and killed it. Yeah, well, we gotta win that competition. God knows we need the money. You'll see it at a competition next week. Yeah, I can't wait. Are you sitting by yourself? You can sit with us if you want. No, uh, my friends, they uh, just left. I'm waiting for my check. Oh, okay. Well, it was nice meeting you. Uh, Roxy. All right, Roxy. See you soon. I'm sorry. I'm a few dollars short. Here you go. Oh my god, thank you. You know, that was really nice of you to do that. But, I mean, you're struggling as it is. Oh, actually, uh, can I get that to go, please? Um, and if it's okay, I'll be waiting outside. Sure. Hey, Mom. Oh. Rough day? Oh. It was a bit hectic but I want to hear about yours. How was cheer practice? It was great. I helped them come up with a new cheer routine and they loved it. Oh, and guess what? I made friends too. It feels good to finally belong, you know? <sighs> Honey, that's wonderful. <sighs> I, I was worried about how the transition was gonna go to the new school, especially with it being private. I'm so happy to hear you made new friends. I know that was a Bit of a struggle for you at Bookside. So, what about you? How's the new job? Mmm. It's been tough. Uh, one of the managers basically copied my work and passed it off as his own. It's so disheartening when you pour your heart into something and he was probably trying to get a promotion. I could never. Integrity matters way more than winning, you know? Mm-hmm. Uh, sorry going through that. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna go shower. Love you, Mom. Love you, too. Shoot that ball! Shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Hey, hey, shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Go, Oh, hey, Roxy. We were just practicing that routine you came up with yesterday. Uh, yeah, about that. Um, there's something I need to tell you guys. I actually have something I want to tell you, too. Do you want to go first, or...? You can. Okay. Well... I decided that after you were able to come up with that routine all by yourself so quickly, that you should be our new captain. <laughs> Me, captain? I, uh, I don't think you understand. I was. Give me an R. R. Give me an O. O. Oh. Give me an X. X. Give me a Y. Y. Yay, Roxy. Yay, Roxy. <laughs> oh, I'm so tired from shopping. I wish we had someone to carry all of our bags. Right? I'm cramping up. Not good, considering our competition's this weekend. 
Either way, I think it's gonna go great. Especially now that we have our new captain. That 10 grand is as good as ours. We should blow it all on shopping. There's this new Chanel belt I'm dying for. Oh, let me show you this Dior bag I wanna get. <laughs> hey, could you all spare a little change? I'm a little short. Ew, oh, you smell. Get it away from us. Yeah, go get a job. The nerve. Anyways, here it is. So cute, right? What an incredible performance by Bookside. Next up, we have Castlemont. All right, guys, this is it. Let's go. Roxy, I know I probably shouldn't be saying this since we're competing, but good luck. Oh, that's so sweet. Thanks, Keisha. Of course. Stop talking to her. Let's go. Shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Hey, hey, shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Hey, hey, shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! talking about? She stole our whole choreography. That was our routine. Roxy? Is that true? Well, uh, um... She would never. Castlemont doesn't need to steal anything from Oakdale. We literally have the same exact routine. Well, then maybe talk to your captain, Ben. Oakdale, everyone's waiting. Hurry up or you're going to have to forfeit. Whatever. They're just jealous of us. Roxy, be honest. Did you take the routine from them? I, um, just... Everyone gets inspiration from somewhere. Who cares about the Oakdale cheer squad? Yeah. Now let's go watch them bomb from the crowd. <laughs> shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Hey, hey, shoot that ball! Shoot, shoot that ball! Woo! Shoot, shoot that, that ball! ball. Shoot, shoot that ball. Hey, hey, shoot that ball. Shoot, shoot that ball. Woo! Shoot that ball. Shoot, shoot that ball. Hey, hey, shoot that ball. Shoot, shoot that ball. Woo! Hey, hey. They literally copied your whole routine. Oh, that is so frustrating. It's just like my manager. I mean, when someone else takes credit for your work, it's like, oh. Well, luckily, you guys got to go first. So hopefully, Oakdale learned their lesson. <laughs> so let's get back in there. They're about to announce the winner. Uh, actually, I just want to go home, if that's all right. You don't want to stay and wait for the results? Okay. Well, where's your bag? Shoot, I left it in the green room. That was so embarrassing. So you didn't steal that routine, did you? No. You girls know me. I would never. I believe you. It just hurts so much that nobody else does. Just because Castlemont is this prestigious private school and we're low-income school doesn't make them right and us wrong. That's unfortunately how it works in this world. Everyone believes those of higher status. The worst part is, I needed that money to help my mom with rent. 
We're two months behind. I promised her she didn't have to worry, and now I don't know what we're going to do. Yeah, I needed that money for my dad's car payment. His car's going to get repoed, and he has to go to work. We ran out of food stamps this month, and I was really counting on that money to help my family. OK, the judges' votes are in. And the winner is... Let's go, girls. Yes. <laughs> Guys, wait! I have a confession to make. I stole Oakdale's routine. You did? Why are you just now saying this? Well... I realized that integrity matters more than winning. I hope I didn't let you down, Mom. Are you kidding me? I am so proud of you. It is never too late to do the right thing. Oh, I have to take this. It's the office. Roxy? Listen, Keisha, I'm so sorry for what I did. I know you probably hate me, and... I, I don't hate you. What you did up there, it took guts. Don't even bother showing your face at practice again. Yeah, last time you ever hang out with us again. Well, I guess they're the ones that hate me. <laughs> if you ask me, good riddance. <laughs> they're not nice girls anyway. Maybe we can hang out sometime? I'd like that a lot. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> I'll see you later. Bye. Mom, did you see? We won, we can pay our rent now. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God, okay, let's go celebrate. That was the CEO. They found out that the manager stole my work, and they fired him. Yeah, and they asked me to be the manager. Oh, oh what? Wow. wow, that's great. Uh, OK, uh, Mom, what do you think of me transferring schools? Again? Please? Honey, how many schools are we no, talking about? No, that is not going to happen. No, I promise you. We're, we're not doing this again. We're not. We're not doing that again. Girl, where did that come from? That was amazing. <laughs> you really think so, Aisha? I mean, I just came up with it. Oh, yeah? I hope you're taking a shot at captain, sis. You know, tryouts are next week for it. Yeah, right, as if a freshman would ever be captain. I mean, you started off captain your freshman year. There's no reason Sabrina can't be it this year. Anyways, I'm heading out. I'll see you guys later. Hey, really think about it, okay? I hope you know you have no chance at being captain. Not only do you not have the skills, look at your face. Ever heard of makeup? My dad doesn't let me wear makeup. Aw, did you guys hear that? Daddy doesn't want his little princess wearing makeup. I bet he styles you and everything, doesn't he? What are you, five years old? Who wears princess shirts in high school? Oh, baby. Mm, little daddy's girl. Hey, look what I got you on oh, my lunch today. Huh? Is everything okay, Sabrina? I'm fine. I mean, are you like... I said I'm fine, Dad. All right, Princess. Don't call me that! <sighs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get mad at you like that. It's okay. Look, we all have bad days. You know, is there anything that I can do to make you feel better? No. Actually, maybe. Is it okay if we stop at Ulta on the way home? Please. The makeup store? You know that you're too young to be wearing makeup. 
<laughs> and you don't need it. You're perfect just the way you are. I'm not too young. I'm 15 now. And all the girls on the dance team wear makeup. So? That doesn't mean that you have to be like them. Listen, sweetheart, there is nothing more beautiful than being yourself, okay? Please, Dad. Take me to Ulta. I'm sorry, Sabrina, but the answer is still no. Hi, Sabrina. How was dance practice? Hey, Sabrina, you don't treat Isabella like that. I'm sorry about that. She's not happy with me right now. You know, these are the times that I miss Georgia the most. She always knew what to do. Anything I can help with? She wants to wear makeup, but she's way too young. I mean, I don't understand why she wants to grow up so fast. Is she really trying to grow up too fast, or maybe you just don't want her to grow up at all? Maybe you should just listen to her. Something probably happened at school or at dance. No, there's no understanding. I am not letting my little princess wear makeup. That's it. That's the thing, Mr. Williams. She's not a little princess anymore. She's a teenager. And the more you tell her not to do something, the more she's going to do it. Just go in there and listen, with an open mind and no judgment. Be her friend, not her father. Sabrina, look, I just wanted to say that I'm sorry if I shouldn't have. Sabrina, what are you wearing? Why, why would you just come in like that? I not. I, look, I don't need to explain. The question is, why do you have half a shirt on, and where did the other half go? I cut it, obviously. And what's the big deal anyways? Everyone at school wears crop tops. It's normal. Oh, really? Well, it might be normal out there, but it's unacceptable here. Oh, you are ruining my life! I'm sorry. Your mother will be better at this stuff than me. I don't want to talk to you about this. You don't get it. Well, then why don't you help me get it? Because what I'm seeing right now, I don't Can you like just it. go? I want to be alone. Well, hello to you too, Sabrina. I'm sorry, Aisha, I didn't even see you there. I'm just trying to be a little incognito. Oh, girl, I know you are not worried about Shayna still. Just ignore her. I don't know, she is right. I don't wear makeup, I don't dress like the rest of you. I'm the oddball out. There's nothing wrong with that. I actually really like your style. It's cool and different, so be confident. Anyway, I'll see you at practice, and I hope you've been practicing your routine for captain tryouts. <laughs> hey, Daddy's girl, where are you going? Home. Aw, little baby Sabrina's going home with her dad, da. I forgot you're a little freshy and don't drive. And what is your princess shirt today? She's probably going to put it on when she gets home to have a tea party with her daddy. Princess, everything okay? How cute. Daddy's come to save his little princess. Maybe he'll get you some warm milk, too. <laughs> hey, who are those girls? Why'd you have to embarrass me in front of them, huh? I wasn't trying to embarrass you. I was trying to protect you. That's the problem. Can't you see I'm not eight years old? I don't need protection. None of this would have happened if you just let me wear makeup and crop tops like I asked you. Then I wouldn't be getting bullied. Princess, I'm sorry. Don't call I... me that. I am not your little princess. Hey, you can't walk home alone. It's dangerous. There you go again, babying me.
What did I say about just coming in here? Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm just getting used to having to knock and ask for permission to come into your room. So, may I please come in? Look, uh, Sabrina, I realize that you're in high school now and I need to work hard to understand you and all the changes that you're going through. You think? I guess I deserve that. And it should have been common sense, but it didn't sink into me until I saw those girls bullying you. So I promise, moving forward, I'm gonna do a better job of understanding you and not trying to control you. Thank you. You're welcome. I also figured while I'm working on understanding you, maybe you would want to know where I'm coming from too. What do you mean? Look, I know it seems like I'm trying to ruin your life, but I promise you it's not that. It's just really hard for me adjusting to all of this. You see, from the moment that you were born and I held you in my arms, everything changed. I knew I was gonna do everything in my power to protect you and keep you safe at all costs. As you grew up, we were inseparable. You tell everyone you were daddy's little princess. And it was true, even your mom would get jealous of how close we were. And then your mom got sick unexpectedly. Her health went downhill so quickly. I wasn't ready for that. I certainly was not ready to raise you on my own. After we lost mom, you became my whole world. And I became so scared of ever losing you too. So, I guess I just became a little overprotective of you. So you see, I know you're not a little girl anymore, Sabrina. It's just been so hard for me to just let go in my mind of you being my little princess. Either way, that's no excuse. And I promise, I am going to try harder. It's okay. I understand, and I'm so sorry too. I just was so upset with those mean girls and their dumb comments. I just wish they would get a life. I forgot. I got you something. Dad, if this is another Disney princess t-shirt, I... I promise it's not. Open it up. This is to show to you how serious I am about listening and everything. I just want... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Dad. You are the best. I love you, sweetheart. But just so you know, you don't need makeup. Dad, makeup. stop. You're doing so good. Don't ruin it. <laughs> so just let me know if you need any help. Not that I know anything about girly stuff, but there's always YouTube. Is there anyone else who wants to try out for captain? I thought Sabrina was going to be here, but I guess not. She's probably getting her diaper changed by her dada. Well then, I guess it's official. For the fourth year in a row, Shayna is... Uh, sorry, I'm late. You already missed it. I was already chosen as captain. That's not true. She's right on time. 
You're not worried that she's better than you, are you? Whatever. If she wants to embarrass herself in front of everyone, she can be my guest. The little baby can cry on her dad dad's shoulder when she loses. Don't talk about my dad, Shauna. I'm serious. Wow. Someone is spicy today. I hope you're not planning on dancing in that ugly hoodie. Nope. I'm wearing... <laughs> you can't be serious. This just gets even better. Did your dad dad buy that for you too? Yes, he did. And for the record, I am my dad's little princess. And I'm proud of it. Okay, can we all just focus on why we're actually here? The dancing? Thank you. Let's see what you got, Sabrina. Girl, that was amazing. It was whatever. All right, well then let's take a vote. All in favor of Shayna, raise your hand. What are you doing? Raise your hands. Sabrina was really good. Yeah, she killed that. Are you kidding? What are you guys doing? Raise your hands. And everyone in favor of Sabrina, raise your hand. <laughs> All right, well, there you have it, Miss Freshman. Everyone give it up for the new captain of the Dancing Divas, Sabrina Williams. This is ridiculous. If she's captain, I'm not dancing on this team. Come on, girls, let's go. Actually, I think we are gonna stay. Yeah, and maybe Sabrina could teach us some new moves. Seriously, you guys are going to choose her over me? You guys are the worst friends ever. What did I tell you? You were right. Thanks for supporting me. I, uh, I think you've got a visitor. <gasps> you won't believe this. I made captain. Of course I believe it. There was not a doubt in my mind. But what I don't believe is, why are you wearing the shirt that I gave you? I mean, where's the crop tops and the makeup? Don't worry. I'll still wear them. But when I want to. Not just to fit in or because someone's bullying me. Because as someone helped me realize, there's nothing more beautiful than being yourself. That makes me so happy. I love you, princess. Oh, I'm sorry. I know that I promised that I wasn't going to call it's you It's okay, Dad. I don't mind. <laughs> hey, what's up? You want a piece of this? Oh, come on. I ain't shouldn't like you for breakfast, okay, Shrimp? buddy? Man, you tripping, bro. I'm a stingray because you about to get stuck. What's this? What's Oh! Man, what the heck was that? That was a technical. I don't see a ref. Bro, you do this all the time. I can't stand you, bro. Where's Noah, man? He was I'll catch up with you guys later. All the time. Oh my God, you're a baby, bro. Hey guys, sorry, what? What in the world? <laughs> what are you wearing? Well, I decided to trap for the cheer team. <laughs> What's so funny? Daddy, you. A cheerleader? <laughs> look, look. I know you live with your stepsister now, but come on. Don't you think this is taking things a little far, buddy? You laugh. <laughs> but trust me, it's underestimated as a sport. <laughs> cheerleading. A sport. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, right. Let me go bang some pom poms. <laughs> oh, wait, I might break a nail. <laughs> Make fun of me all you want. Cheerleading has its perks, and I stand by my choice. <laughs> yeah, you you for sure tripping, because there is nothing cool about. Who is that? That's Madison. She's our new cheer captain. She transferred from Piner a few weeks ago. I ain't gonna lie, I kind of take back what I say, because maybe there are a few perks. Well, you know, as a fellow leader, I should welcome her. Watch and learn, boys. Oh but God. she has to go for... It's never gonna work. I even tried once. She turned me down. Well, that doesn't mean anything because... Everyone turns you down. Oh, really? Girls have you gone. But Jay, <laughs> he got one kiss on the cheek from a girl. And now he thinks he's rico suave. Hey, uh, Madison, right? No, I'm Jay. 
I figured I'd introduce myself, seeing as you're the captain of the cheer squad, and I'm captain of the basketball team. You feel? Hey, best of the best gotta stick together. <laughs> Is that right? I'm just saying, being at the top doesn't have to be such a lonely place. Hey, if you're down, you know, <laughs> I'd love to take you out for ice cream sometime. Say, so, hey, darlings tonight? Uh, as exciting as that offer sounds, I'm gonna have to pass. Sorry. <laughs> um, you probably didn't hear me, but um, <laughs> no, let me start. Jay. I heard you the first time. I just don't date basketball players. Sorry. <laughs> Come on, girl. Well, we were watching, and we definitely didn't learn anything. Well, other than seeing you get rejected. Dog, it's not my fault. She said she doesn't like basketball players. What's mm. her deal? I tried to warn you. I think she only wants to date someone who actually respects cheerleading. Hmm. For the first time in your life, you may actually be right about something. I just got an idea. Noah, haha, <laughs> buddy old pal. Where'd you get that uniform? It's go time. Let's go, baby. Here we go. Let's go, team. Here we go. Let's go, team. Woo! Okay, that was better. But if we're gonna win regionals, we need something extra special for the ending. Something that'll make our choreography stand out. Anyone have any ideas? Yo. Uh, this is a closed practice for cheerleaders only. You can't be here or be wearing our uniforms. Uh, yeah, I can. Because I just signed up to be on the squad, so... Is this some kind of joke? Mm -mm. You can't cheer and play ball. They're on the same schedules. Yeah, but technically basketball's still in preseason, so we've got like a month into our first real game. So until then, my schedule's wide open. Don't you need a practice? 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 We talking about practice? Like, I'm like Iverson. I don't need to practice. Come on now. You know, it might not be a bad idea. We could use another guy on the squad. Yeah. And with another base on our team, it could help us escalate our routine for regionals. Isn't that what you wanted? Fine. But one wrong move and you're out. Got it? Whoa, 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 whoa. No one gives me orders. Not even my mom. But for a pretty girl like you, I'll make an exception. One more thing. Save the cheesy pickup lines for someone who cares. All right? OK, let's try partner stunt. Lily, I want you to do a QP. Jay, your base. A what now? Just lift her above your head so she can stand on your palms. Ah, uh, a copy. QP. QP. Uh. Yeah, that, that's a piece of cake. So what do I do? I just... Dip on three, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, dip, three, up, four. Just. just... <laughs> no. I can get you some pom-poms if this is too hard for you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is not too hard for me, okay? I got this. Just... Let me try again. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, dip, three, up, four, five. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Oh. Man, this is a lot harder than it looks. I can't feel my calves. I think my arms are about to fall off. I tried to tell you. It's a sport. This isn't a sport. This is torture. Yo, Jay, where were you? We missed you at practice. Dude, are you seriously wearing a cheerleading outfit? No. Uh, <laughs> I was about to say, you should come to the arcade with us. But maybe you should go get your nails done with my sister. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Mikey, check out your best friend. Jada. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Jay, what are you wearing? First Noah, now you relax. It's just going to be for a couple of weeks until I can get Madison to go on a date with me. All right. Look, I'll be back in time for the game against Montgomery. All right, chill. Oh. Yeah, but the sooner the better, because the last thing I need to be known as is the guy that hangs around with Jada, 
Noella. Hey, you can do a lot worse than us, all right? I mean, he ain't lying. Now, uh, if you'll excuse us, we've got some choreography to learn. Come on, Noella. Wait, did you just call me Noella? Too bad. I got an appetite, let's bake ourselves a treat. What you've been mixing, serve it up the way you Dang. please. I love Five, the way six, you seven, eight. One, two, watching YouTube last night, and I think I found just what our ending needs for regionals. Oh, yeah? You know, at first I thought you started cheering as some sort of gimmick, but now I'm seeing that you actually really care. I must say, I'm impressed. I'll see you at practice? For sure. Here. Thanks. Yo, Jay! Where have you been? You've missed the last three weeks of practice. Yeah, we've got the Montgomery game coming up. Remember? Yeah, I, I know, man. I've just been trying to balance that with this whole cheer thing. Then there's this important competition. Really? Thing. So you're saying it's more important than our game? Or than our team? No, Mikey, don't twist my words, man. You know I didn't mean it like that. Good, because otherwise we'll need to find a new captain. A lot of the guys are talking, especially after that TikTok in the fire. Hey, Jesus. what TikTok? You don't know. Wait, no, 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 show it to me, show it to me. Who knows about this? Oh, I don't know, maybe like everyone? Even my cousin at Elmhurst sent it to me. Look, dude, if you want to continue being our team captain, or showing your face around the school at all, then you gotta decide. What's more important, basketball or this? Yeah. Don't disappoint us, Jay. Five, six, seven, eight. Here we go. Yes. Let's go, team. Here we go. Let's go, team. Woo. Jay, over here. Okay, I told the girls about the ending you came up with, and they're all excited to see it. Actually, Madison, I have something to tell you. Oh, if it's about the front walkover in the routine, I'm sure you could figure something out. No, no, it's not that. I just came to tell you that I can't make the competition next week or any more practices. I've been giving it a lot of thought, and I think I need to focus my time on basketball. But I don't understand. I thought you said you could do both. I mean, yeah, but there's also the fact that lots of people have been making fun of me for cheering. So you care more about other people's opinions than your own team? No. Look, Madison, I'm sorry, okay? Don't be sad. Sad? You think I'm sad? I should have known. You're a basketball player. All you're good for is broken promises and disappointment. Come on, guys, let's get back to cheering. Yo! Jay, come on, we got a game, bro. Get defense and... Call me. Five, seven, eight. Here we go. 
Let's, Let's go, go team. team. Here, Here we go. go. Let's go, go team. team. All right, so Good on job, formation, team. we got defense. Good job, guys. Defense, do never. <laughs> Jay, come on. What's the matter? Yeah, you good, man? Come on, get it together. We got a game tonight. Bro, Montgomery's gonna wish they were never born once you're done wiping the floor with them. Yeah, for sure. I'll catch up with you later, all right? Um, hey, Madison, what's up? Hey. Hey, Jay. So I couldn't make it to school today. So can you give me the notes from... Is everything okay? Yeah. Everything's 100%. Cool, fine. All right. The truth is, I messed up. I had this whole plan to do cheer for a few weeks so I could impress this one girl, Madison. After I get her to like me, I'd go back to playing basketball. It was supposed to be a simple plan. But after a while, I realized I don't just like her. I mean, I like Sharon too. It's pretty cool. Okay, so what's the problem here? Everyone's making fun of me for it. Even my teammates gave me a hard time. So I quit cheering and went back to basketball. But now Madison and all the girls are mad at me and I don't know what to do. <sighs> do you remember when we were at the dance? You were worried people would think of you if they knew you liked Taylor Swift. How nice was it when you stopped caring what they thought and we danced to anti-hero? It was the best. I still think about that sometimes. Exactly. I know it's not easy. Being yourself is hard. But it's still better than being someone you're not. So I say, don't care what anyone thinks. Just do what makes you happy. Shoot it, shoot it! Bro! Jay, get it together! That was like the 10 shot you were made! I don't know. Come on, guys, let's go! Go, 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 go! Take the shot, take the shot! Ref! Ref, ref, ref! Come on, bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. Yo, what's going on with you, Jay? Where's your head at? I'm sorry, coach. I... Look, we're down two points. You're going to need to sink a three to win this. You hear me? Yeah. All right, well, get some water for we get back. Hmm? Yo, Noah, what happened? I mean, why aren't you at regionals right now? I was there, but I slipped and twisted my ankle. What? How, how is the squad going to compete without you? They need at least one base. They're not. They're packing up and dropping out. No, 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 no. We cannot drop out. Okay, everyone's worked way too hard for this. Jay, come on. Let's go. Jay, come on, go to the end and I'll pass you the rock. Nah, man. I'm sorry, but I gotta go. What? Jay, what are you doing? We have a game. What I should have done all along. Hey, he'll be fine, though. Mikey, where is he going? Jay! <laughs> Time's up. We gotta play or we gotta lose possession. What's the plan, coach? All right, pass the ball to Mikey, and you're gonna have to make the shot at the buzzer, all right? You got okay, this. yeah, I got it. You got, got this, it. all right. Books out on three. Books out on three. One, One two, two, three. three. Books out. out. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Noah told me what happened, so I got here as quickly as I could. It isn't too late, is it? Why do you care? You left, remember? I know, and I'm sorry, okay? I guess it took me quitting to see that this is something I really enjoy doing. So just please give me one more chance, okay? I promise I'll make it up to you. Why should we? So you can ditch us the second people start making fun of you again? No, I don't care about that anymore. People can make fun of me all they want because this is something I enjoy doing. The judges scored them 28.1 points. What an incredible performance by Lincoln Middle School. Unfortunately, our next team, Bookside, won't be competing today. They had a dancer get injured. Please, this is our last chance. Even though you're mad at me, don't take this out on everyone else. We never even figured out an ending for a routine. 
Oh, <laughs> don't worry about that. I got a little something up my sleeve. You guys are still here? Do you want to compete? enough for us to win. All right, the judges have voted. Bookside has a 9, 9.3, and a 9.7. Putting them in second place, which means Lincoln Middle got first place. Yay. <sighs> we did our best. Yeah, we tried. Who this? Oh. Yo. How'd it go? Second place. <sighs> Man, I feel like I let everyone down today. First, our basketball team lost, another squad. I... What are you talking about? We didn't lose. I hit a game winning three. Whoa, 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 whoa. For real? Yup. You're now looking at Bookside's new basketball captain. Woohoo! Um, uh, congrats, dude. Thanks. You deserve it. Hey, Jay, you have a minute? Yeah. I'll call you guys later, all right? Peace. Look, I'm sorry we didn't win. I mean, I know you're probably upset. Are you kidding? We got second place. That's further than Bookside's ever gotten. And that ending, it was really cool. You did great. Thanks, Madison. That actually means a lot coming from you. Look, I know we got off to a rough start, but what you did today, after how people were making fun of you for cheering, that took guts. And it made me think about some things. So I wanted you to know I changed my mind about basketball players. Whoa, 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 whoa. So you're telling me you give a ball player a shot at dating you? Mm-hmm. Ooh, that is in my girl. That's the greatest news ever. I mean, we can finally go get milkshakes at Darling. Alex! <laughs> You're dating a Montgomery player? Mm-hmm. I'm way too young to be going through all this heartbreak. People say she's gonna get first place. I bet she won't even medal. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about it, honey. You're doing great. I don't get it. I've done a back walk over 100 times. Why am I messing up now? Well, it's just probably your nerves. It's no big deal. Look, we got a big day tomorrow. We all know you're gonna pick up the most points on bars and floor anyway, so don't stress too hard about it. We should do bars, right? Yeah. Yeah. If I want a chance at winning first all around, then I'm gonna need to try it again. She's the boss. <laughs> Great start. See, she's doing great. Yeah. Right here, go to go. <laughs> and people say she's going to be the next Chloe Ramsey. <laughs> she's never going to be as good as her mom. She doesn't even deserve the last name. <laughs> hey. 
Hey, what happened? Well, why did you leave? Because you couldn't do that. It's not that, Dad. Was it those girls? Because I'm going to go over there and talk. No! Please don't. If you do, it'll just make things worse. Brooklyn and Roxy are annoying, but I'm used to it. Okay. And what is it? I miss Mom. I wish she was here. Yeah, I know, honey. I miss her, too. I promised Mom I would win. And now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep that promise. I don't want to let Mom down. Sweetheart, you're not letting her down. All she ever wanted was for you to do your best. And look, you already made sectionals. I mean, how many kids can say that? I know, but I can't believe I can't even land a back walkover the day before my competition. Ugh, I feel like such a failure. Don't feel that way. Hey, butterfly. No, please, don't call me that. It feels weird coming from you. You know, if your mom was here, what do you think she would say to you? She'd say, Ava, the only way that you'll ever fail is if you stop trying. So, as long as you don't quit, you're already winning, right? All right, kiddo, we got a big day tomorrow, okay? So why don't we just call it and head back to the Airbnb? I still need to practice bars, then we can go home. Also, don't call me kiddo anymore. That's how you land a back walkover. Want to keep working on the beam? I'm going to switch to bars. I'll be right there. So, uh, you think she's got a shot tomorrow? Physically, she's doing amazing. She has been preparing for this moment for a very long yeah. time. What I'm worried about is her mentality. I can tell she's got a lot going on in her head, and that's probably why her balance is off. Well, she had a rough year, that's for sure. To be honest, I'm surprised she kept training. Most people would have either taken time off or given up completely. Ava's definitely a fighter. She gets that from her mom. I really hope I'm not overstepping, but if you don't mind me asking, what happened? I mean, I, I read the papers, but it didn't really say too much about. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have. No, no, it's okay. It's fine. You're her coach. You should know. Uh, I just everything happens so fast. You see, ever since Ava was little, the only thing she was more obsessed with, more than gymnastics, was her mom. Ava looked up to her and wanted to be just like her. How does it feel winning? Feels pretty good. But you know what feels even better? What? This special moment right now. Do you think I'll ever win a medal? Like you? If you work hard, anything's possible. Well, looks pretty good on you. Thank you. She stayed a mommy's girl even as she got older. Ava would always be trying to impress her with what she learned, almost as if she had something to prove. And if she ever stumbled. Sweetheart, are you OK? I wanted to make you proud. Butterfly, you already have. No, I failed. You haven't failed. The truth is, you haven't failed unless... If I stop trying. So let's do it again, and this time make sure that you try... <coughs> make sure to try... would have thought Chloe would go from being an Olympic athlete to a few weeks later not even being able to get out of bed. Are you going to get better, Mom? I don't know, honey. 
There's a chance I may never get better. Listen to me. Promise me that you'll never give up on your dreams. Okay, butterfly? I'm gonna win sectionals, and one day I can go to the Olympics like you, Mom. I promise I'm gonna make you proud. I promise. So you see, a short time after that, Ava's mom was gone. It's the cancer just spread so quick. And I just... Ow! Ow! <laughs> you okay? What happened? Winning tomorrow's gonna be easier than I thought. If that's our competition tomorrow, we have nothing to worry about. <laughs> hey! Uh Got you a new ice pack. There you go. So how are you holding up? I'm fine. Oh wow. I wanted mom to be here to see me win. She's always with you, honey. Always. Why don't you get some rest? Uh, is there anything else I can get you? No. I love you, kiddo. Love you too, Dad. Beam, Jordan's doing an aerial, Salish is doing a backhand spring. Let's do it. I love that. Hey, I had some breakfast. Were you just watching a Jordan and Salish video? Yeah, I know that they're your favorite YouTubers, and since I'm new to the old gymnastic thing, I want to learn some tips. You know, they're really uh, cute together, huh? Hey, have some cereal. I guess you didn't learn you're not supposed to have dairy before a competition. Oh, shoot. All this kind of stuff was your mom's department, I'm sorry. That's okay, I don't really like to eat a lot before a competition anyways. I'll just take a banana. Okay. Um, you ready? Yeah. Hey Ava, I just want to let you know that this whole competition, it's not about winning or losing, Dad, it's more... you don't have to try to say the perfect thing all the time. I'm not a little girl anymore. I'm ten. I'll be fine. Now let's go. It's all right, 8.8 .8 is still great. It's hey, good. good thing bars are next. I'm sure you're gonna do great. You need at least a 9.3 to tie Brooklyn for overall before the last round and a 9.05 to medal here. Hey, look, this is what you're best at. You got this. I just hope I don't fall again. Don't think about the times you fell. Think about the times that got you here in the first place, okay? Okay? All right, let's go. We can do this, Ava. You got this, Ava, let's go. to 
great yeah. start. Don't feel bad. That was good. It was good. There's a chance you could still get a 9.05, okay? I told you she would a medal. There is no way she's coming back now. Hey, will you two stop? I mean, I get this as a competition and everything, but your little comments are unnecessary. Aw, are you protecting your little baby? How cute. And to think Ava said she's gonna go to the Olympics one day. What a joke. What is she trying to do? Be her mom? <laughs> hey. Dad, stop! No, I'm not gonna let them talk to you that way. This is your problem. You're always treating me like a little baby. You know what? I don't even wanna do this anymore. I'll be right back. Hey, Ava, honey. Please, just leave me alone. I don't need one of your dumb pep talks to try to make me feel better. I'm over gymnastics. I quit. What? No, you can't I quit. said go away. If you want to help, go in and tell them I'm done. No way. <laughs> You're Jordan Matter. Yeah, hi. <laughs> hi, hi. Hi. You. You're Silas. Ow, I, I didn't realize you guys would be here. Yeah. I hate to do this, but um, do you think that one of you could possibly talk to my daughter? Is everything okay? Not really. Dad, I already told you how... <gasps> Your dad told me everything that's been going on. Can I sit? Sorry, I'm still freaking out. I can't believe it's you. <laughs> so, how's it going? I'm totally bombing this competition. I can't seem to land anything. My coach says that I'm too much in my head. I feel like such a failure right now. Aw. You know, the same thing happened to me at a competition last year. I got nervous and I got a mental block. You, Salish Matter, regional champion, got nervous? <laughs> the regional championships don't have anything to do with it. Even Simone Biles, one of the top gymnasts in the world, still gets nervous, and it's perfectly normal. It doesn't make you a failure. Thanks. My mom used to say the only way you'll ever fail is if you stop trying. Your mom sounds like a very smart lady. Any word? Well, all right. Unfortunately, we're just gonna have to cut I'm her here, from the- I'm here, Sorry, I just needed a few minutes. Whenever you're ready. Listen, Ava, if you don't wanna go for the back walkover, it's completely okay. Safety is most important. You should listen to your body if you need to, you know. It's fine, I'm going to do it. I'll be fine. All right, well, Brooklyn got a 9.05 on this. So if you want to win overall, you need at least a 9.5. I've never scored that high. Are you gonna go or not? Hey, don't let him get in your head. Good luck, honey. Let's go. Yeah, let's go, come on. Great. We'll see. It will come down to whether or not she can land this back walk over. <laughs> you did it! <laughs> There she is. There you go. Got your favorite. Is everything okay? Will you 
used to always come here with Mom after her competitions. I know. Some of my favorite memories are on this bench. So do you want to wear your medal? Maybe if it was gold. Do you think Mom's disappointed I lost? First of all, you didn't lose, all right? Second place is still amazing. And even if you didn't place at all, look, your mother is up there looking down on you. She's so proud. I don't believe that. Oh, look. <laughs> that was so cool. See? What did I tell you? She's looking over you. Hey, you want to wear your medal now? Here, hold that. Da 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 da. Here you go. Dad. What? You're doing it again. You're looking at me like that. I'm sorry. I. I'm sorry, kiddo. I mean, sweetheart. Apologize. I decided you could call me kiddo or butterfly. Just don't overdo it. All right, okay. I'll try my best. Nice shot. <laughs> we make a great team. I know. We're like <laughs> funny, Clyde. I, I was thinking more like Michael Jordan, Scotty Pippen. <laughs> but I, I guess that works too. <laughs> hey, you know what? They're having a two on two competition at Light Echo Park this Friday. You want to go? School dances this Friday. Oh. Yeah, I totally forgot. <laughs> um, are you going? I was thinking about it, but I don't have anyone to go with. Maybe you and I could... Hey, Lucas. Oh, hey, Jess. What's up? Not much. I just saw your last game, and you were incredible. Ah, <laughs> thanks. I didn't, I didn't even know you liked basketball. Yeah, I mean, I can't shoot a basket or anything. Maybe you could teach me? Yeah, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Carly, you want to join us? Oh. Sure. I, I... Actually, I was thinking this would be our one-on-one -on -one thing. Sorry. Oh. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I'll see you later, Lucas. Well, was, was there something you were asking me? Uh, it's not important. We can talk another time. Okay. <laughs> Good game! But I thought you were going to ask him to the dance. I was about to. Until we were interrupted. And just, that's it right there. Just follow through. It looks hard. No, you got it. Give it a shot. It looks like he has a date already. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? No way. He's not going with her. He's totally into you. I'm clearly not his type. He's into girls that. Wear cute clothes, nice hair, put on a lot of makeup. Like girly girl. Lucas is the sweetest guy ever. He's probably just helping her to be nice. Yeah, right, Brielle. You wanna hit that follow through, okay? Like this. Here, try again. Okay. I can't do it by myself. <laughs> okay, just here, here. All right. Perfect. All right, show this back. And keep an eye on the ring. There we go, get it. <laughs> Okay, you'll get it. <laughs> He's totally into the helpless type. I bet you if I dressed like that and acted like her, Lucas would ask me out. What? No, besides, you should never pretend to be someone you're not. How do you know he's not already planning to ask you out? He didn't remember the dance was Friday. Probably shouldn't have reminded him because now he's probably going to ask Jessica. I'm gonna go. I'll see you tomorrow. 
Don't be like that. Hey! Carly? So, how do I look? Uh, did you seriously do this for- Can you just answer the question? I mean, you look great, but skirt and makeup, this isn't you. Okay, but this is what Lucas likes, so this is the new me. You really think Lucas is gonna like this? You look like a completely different person. This is the only way I'll get a chance with him, okay? Oh, <laughs> look at you. You like it? Yeah, well, it's different, <laughs> but not in a bad way. It is gonna be interesting trying to see you hoop with those nails. But with your help, I'm sure I'll be okay. Yeah, I guess so. Actually, um, I was wondering, what are you doing tomorrow? I don't know, um, probably like shopping or something like that. Cool stuff, bye. I just, I wanted to see if you wanna go on a hike with me. Really? I mean, I guess I can probably go shopping on Sunday. I'd love to go hiking. Cool. Um, I'll just, I'll, I'll text you later with the details. Okay. Okay. Sounds good to me. Bye. 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 You even sound different. Yeah, but it worked, didn't it? Say how fast he asked me to hang out. <sighs> Him asking you to go hiking had nothing to do with this new you. How do you know? Come on, Carly, you really think in the two minutes he was over here, something magically clicked inside him and he thought to himself, oh wow, Carly's a girly girl now. Should ask her out. Yeah, that's exactly what I think happened. Do you need help? Uh, yes, please. Hey. These books are just so heavy and I'm so weak. Oh, it's okay, I got you. Actually, I, I could just carry them for you. Where are you headed? Oh, you are so sweet, Lucas. I'm headed to math class. Okay, no problem. <laughs> I'm not doing enough. Just stop it and be you. This is me, Brielle. Now get used to it. She walks differently. You really thought those boots were a good idea. <laughs> They're the cutest ones I could find. Yeah, it's the cutest way to a sprained ankle. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> okay, let's go. We got it. Good. You all right back there? No. This bag is just so heavy. You, you want me to take it for a bit? Well, maybe I could hold on to you for some extra support. Yeah, okay, that's fine. <laughs> yeah. So what, what made you do that whole switch up? I mean, like, you know, the hair and everything. Oh, I guess I just wanted to show everyone a different side of me, you know? Yeah, I get that. You know, I guess they say, get you a girl who can do both, right? <laughs> right, but this is more me, though. You know, the girly girl vibes. <laughs> wow, okay. I would never guess that. Almost to the falls. This bridge is the halfway point. Yeah. All right, let's keep going. Yeah. Ready? Give me a sec. 
like okay? What are you doing? Sorry, I just need to make sure my makeup is okay. Why? <laughs> We're in the middle of hiking. There's literally no one here for you to impress. Still, can't be out here looking crazy. What if someone comes? I didn't think you cared so much about that kind of stuff. I'm much more of a girly girl than you think, Lucas. <sighs> yeah, I'm realizing that. Hold on. How do I look? You look great. All right, come on, let's get back on it. Come on, we got this. Lucas! Help me! Get it off! What's wrong? Get it off! What's wrong? It's a bug! Get it! What please! It? <laughs> it's a caterpillar. Come on, they're completely harmless. Like, come on. No, please! Oh, okay, 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 relax. It's off. You're good. Sorry. I'm so scared of bugs. Thanks for saving me. You know what? Um, you want to do something else? I don't, I, don't, I don't know. I just kind of feel like hike is not really your thing. I'm sorry. I'm just not good with nature stuff. We can keep going though. I'll be okay. No, um, it's getting late. Let's just head back. Are you sure? Yep. Lucas? What you got? Come on. What are you doing? I don't know. Dribbling? Well, if it ain't Mighty Mouse and her sidekick, you guys trying to have a rematch? Oh, so you guys can get spanked again? Sure. Let's go. All right, then. Let's do it. Come on, Carly, check the ball. <laughs> what does that mean? Come on, enough of the jokes. All right, pass me the ball. Come on, I'll check it. Just go. Jeremiah, work back up. There you go. Uh, my ball, my ball, my ball. Come on, take the shot. Take the shot, come on. There you go. That's it, baby. For real, Carly? I don't know what happened. Making us lose. Yep, that's us. All right. It's too easy. You want us right here? Just get it. 
Yo, are you all right? No, I need you to help me out. It barely seemed like you fell. I did, my ankle hurts. Come on. All right, you're good. Come on, let's get in. Aren't you gonna carry me? You barely fell. I think you're fine. I did, my ankle hurts. I, I guess we're done, guys. Wow. <laughs> I think that's the first time we ever beat you guys. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, good game. I guess. What happened to you? What do you mean? I fell. I'm not talking about that. Never mind. I guess you're not really the girl I thought you were. What's that supposed to mean? Okay. You're looking different. You're acting different. The way you were just playing basketball. I don't even know who you are right now. But I miss the old you. I just thought this is what you wanted. What are you talking about? Why would I want you to be like this? I don't know. Look, I gotta go. But I'll see you at school tomorrow. Lucas, wait! <sighs> Glad to have you back. Don't start. I think I may have ruined things with Lucas. I texted him and uh, he never texts me back. And he always responds to me. Just give him some time. I'm sure he'll get over it. Oh yeah. <laughs> He's over it all right. He's about to ask Jessica to the dance. I give up. I tried being myself and he didn't want me and I tried being a girly girl and he didn't want me. Carly, I don't know what else to do. Something must be wrong with me. Carly, I'm not at the dance for y'all. I'm not going- Carly, I can't handle seeing them together. going on? I wanted to see if you'd like to go to the dance with me. Really? I, I thought you hated me after everything that happened. You didn't even text me back. Well, that's actually because I lost my phone. <laughs> but no, I could never hate you. In fact, I really like you. You do? Yeah. But, you know, the real version of you. A little better than that, the other version, to be honest. And this whole time I thought you wanted to be with a girly girl. Oh, wait. What would give you that idea? I saw you and Jessica and thought she was the type of girl you wanted to be with. No. No, not at all. I, she's, she's not really my type. <laughs> wait, hold on. Is, is that why you... <sighs> Carly, come on, I, I can't believe you. I like you for who you are. Besides, you should never pretend to be someone you're not. Okay? Told you. Have you been listening? <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help it. <laughs> oh no, it's fine. I didn't know we had an audience. <laughs> <laughs> Carly, I love you be Bonnie, and I'll be Clyde, <laughs> and we hit this dance together. Sure. I thought we could be Michael Jordan and Scottie Pippen instead. <laughs> hey, as long as I get to be Jordan. No way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh no. Could you help me with Lucas? Sorry. You can get those yourself. Football? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Regina. It's about time I start teaching you how to throw around a football, huh? But I don't want this. Zane, that's a great gift. And you should be more appreciative. 
Now thank Regina for getting it for you. Thanks, Aunt Regina. You're welcome. Um, ooh, how about we open this one next? Are these ballet shoes? I know how badly you've been wanting to take dance class, so I had to get them for you. You got me the whole outfit. Thanks, Mom. Of course, sweetie. Why would you get him that? I mean, ballet is practically all he ever talks about. But I don't want my boy dancing around like a ballerina. Okay, what he needs to be learning to play with is this Hank, right here. Let's talk about this later, okay? Why don't we let Zane open the rest of his gifts? I choose this one. Hey, have you seen my keys? Uh, no. Oh, shoot, we're gonna be late. Gosh, I could have sworn. I found them. Thank you. Really, Katrina? This is what you got our son looking like? Hank, why would you say that? What's wrong, Dad? Don't you like it? It's not that, sweetie. Your father is just a little bit more traditional. Do you want to wish Zane good luck, Hank? It's his first day. Dad? It's okay, honey. Let's go. No, there'd be only girls here. Uh, if you want me to stay, I can. No, I'll be fine. You sure? Okay. Have fun. <laughs> um, what's so funny? Don't tell me you're here to dance with us. Um, yeah. Why? Is there something wrong with that? Oh, nothing. If you're a little sissy boy. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. I assume all you ladies are here to try out for the ballet team. <laughs> Is there something funny, young lady? We actually have a boy here, too. But you may as well count him as a girl. <laughs> Stop it. Are you here to try out? Uh, yeah. Is that okay? Of course it is. All right, everybody stand up. We're gonna start with the five basic positions. First position, heels together, toes out, arms down. Second position, point your right Sissy. foot, open your arms. Third position on the right, bring the heel of the right foot in towards the eight. Whew. Okay, moving on. We're going to do turns now. We're gonna end the day with pirouettes. Now pirouettes can go in different directions, but today we're going to concentrate on en dehors or outward turns. Like this. All right, your turn. Good. Point your foot. <laughs> Perfect, Claire. That was gorgeous. Thank you. All right, Zane, let's see what you got. I need more practice. That's okay. That's the reason we're here, right? Just give it your best shot. All right. This should be good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you hurt? Uh, yeah. I'll be fine. You just need a little more practice, that's all. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe you should just realize that ballet is for girls, not boys. Even if there are little sissy boys like you. <laughs> very concerned about Zane today, Claire. Why is that? Are you scared he's gonna take your spot? <laughs> yeah, right. You can't even do a basic pirouette without falling down. That doesn't mean he won't get better. Speaking of which, everybody should be practicing. 
You only have a few weeks left before I make my final decision about who's on the team. Good work today, everyone. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. I hope you're not planning on coming back tomorrow, unless you want to embarrass yourself again. <laughs> I don't care what you say. I'm not going back again tomorrow. Please, don't let those meat girls get to you. You know, you've always wanted to do ballet. Not if I'm the only boy. It's so embarrassing. What, where are you going? Zane? Wait. Happy now? Please, the last thing I need right now is a lecture. I'm just saying, there's a reason why boys play football and girls do ballet. It's just the way it's always been. Well, times have changed, Hank. Or at least I thought they had. You know, honestly, this is a great thing. Hopefully, this could be the wake-up call he needed. He's still obsessed with ballet, but now he's just too afraid to be himself. <laughs> Trust me, once I get him playing a real manly sport, ballet will be the last thing on his mind. He's just a little confused right now. <laughs> what are you saying? He's been confused since he was five? What are you talking about? I mean... We both know that ever since he was a little kid, he liked butterflies and unicorns, you know? Not trucks and guns. You can't force him to like something that he just doesn't care about. Yeah, and how has that worked out for him? Hmm? He just gets made fun of and comes home crying. Yeah, but that doesn't make it wrong for him to love what he loves. I mean, it's not his fault that people are mean. Don't you want your son to know that he can be anything he wants to be in this life? Yes, I just wish it wasn't a ballerina. Why can't he like stuff the other boys are into? Do you remember the first time he heard an Ariana Grande song on the radio? I mean, after that, for a whole year, that is all he wanted to listen to. I mean, every car ride, it was, put on Ariana Grande, put on Ariana Grande. Mm. He had an Ariana Grande themed birthday and even you dressed up. I remember. Mm -hmm. And none of the other boys did that. They were all into superheroes and wrestling. The truth is, Zane has always been different, but that is what makes him so, so special. And we just have to accept him as he is. I just don't know how to do that. What other option do we have? Crush your kid's dreams and have him resent you for the rest of your life, only to have him grow up and do what he wants anyway? We don't need to change him, but we do have to support him. Okay. So what's the plan? <laughs> I, I mean, he already said he's not going back to ballet and, unless there's another boy, so. Well. I did have a feeling that something like that might happen when I dropped him off, so. I posted on Facebook to see if there were any other parents who had boys who wanted to take a ballet class. Why would you post that, Katrina? People are just gonna judge us. Can you please just delete it? Are you kidding me? Look, look at all these comments. I mean, there are so many moms who have boys who are interested in ballet and they wanna join. Look, no. I mean, there is nothing embarrassing about this, Hank. I guess times really have changed, huh? The dad finally begins to accept his son as he really is. A few days later, the mom brings Zane to practice. At first, he doesn't want to go. But once he finds out that other boys are there, he finally feels comfortable. He practices ballet at the studio. He practices at home by himself. He even practices with his mom and his dad. 
Zayn keeps practicing and over time starts to get really good. And then came the day of tryouts. You sure you don't want me to come in with you? I'll be all right. Okay. Good luck. You're so going to make the team. I know. Whoa. I'm surprised to see you here. We thought you'd never come back. Well, I decided I may as well try out. For what? To embarrass yourself again? <laughs> yeah, you're just gonna make a fool out of yourself in front of everyone. Actually, I've been practicing a lot and I've gotten pretty good. <laughs> Can I ask you something? Did you choose ballet because you're too afraid to play a manly sport? Uh, no. Oh, it's a little sissy boy scared to get hurt. <laughs> no, just leave me alone. Oh, look how sensitive he's getting. He probably cries a lot too. Oh, careful. Looks like he might start crying right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, forget this. Zane, honey, what's wrong? Those girls were making fun of me again. I'm sorry, sweetie, but... You know, you can't let them get to you. They're just bullies. I just want to go home. Zane. Hey, how'd it go? Well, not good. He's getting bullied again, and he doesn't even want to go inside. <sighs> I feel so bad for him. You know, I, I, I don't know what to do. I guess probably just come back home. Hold on, just... Actually, I've got an idea. Whatever you do, just keep him there. Oh, I don't know if I can... Hello? Go. I know, honey, but your dad said... I don't care what he said. I just want to leave. Okay, can you put your seatbelt on, please, then? What in the world? Dad? What do you think? Why are you dressed up as... Men can't be ballerinas? No, they can. <laughs> nice pants. Oh, thanks. To be honest, I thought that you would be happy that I wasn't auditioning. I know that you don't want me to be a ballerina. And the old me would have loved that. But the new me... I realize you can be anything you want, including a... A ballerina? Yes. Including a ballerina. I don't want to change you. I just want to support you. Thanks, Dad. That means a lot. But if you change your mind with any sports... Hey, and... Just stop. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Where are you going? To prove to those girls that boys can do ballet. Come on, let's go. <laughs> okay. That was great. Thank you. Okay, I believe Claire was the last one, which means that it's time for me to make my decision. Wait, about... wait, Zane wants to try out. Well, welcome back, Zane. Come on in. Wow, Zane, I didn't realize that your dad was a little sissy boy, too. Hey! You know, Claire, I could have you completely disqualified for your remarks. Is that what you want? That's what I thought. Go ahead, Zane. Good luck. You got this. Look, there's another boy trainer. You all right? Can I please try again? I'm sorry. Everyone only gets one chance. So I guess I didn't make the team. <laughs> Did you really think that you ever had a chance? You just completely embarrassed yourself again. Hey, at least he tried. Yeah, whether he makes the team or not. 
so proud of him. Says the man wearing tights. Okay, cut it out. That's enough, Claire. Okay. This has been a very tough decision. But unfortunately, only four of you can be on the team. So this year's dancers will be Casey. Kimberly. Alex. And the last dancer is Clay. Congratulations, Clay. What? You're seriously gonna pick a boy over me, but I'm the best dancer here. That might be true. It's not gonna get you very far if you also have the worst attitude. Ugh. Thank you very much for coming, everyone. I hope we will see you next year for auditions. Sorry you didn't make the team, bud. We are so, so proud of you. That's okay. At least I got to try. Yeah. Same way. I'm sorry things didn't work out today, but here. There's another team close by. They're looking for more dancers. You should try there. Thanks, but I don't think I want to do ballet anymore. Oh, okay. No worries. Take care, you guys. Thank you again. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Well, I am very surprised. I thought you loved ballet. Yeah, I thought this was um, your dream. I think it was just a phase. Maybe I'll try again in the future. But I'm ready for a new sport. OK. What were you thinking? I don't know. Maybe cheerleading. What do you think, Dad? You said I could be anything I really want in life. Right? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I was actually thinking soccer. Really? Okay. W whatever you want. Should we go to the park and practice? Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good to me. But can I change first? Because these are a little, uh, a little tight. <laughs> <laughs>